this week we're in Austin! Today I'm taking you on a Texas barbecue food truck tour to enjoy some of the best barbecue here in Austin, Texas. I'm Julia Gonzalez and I hope you join me. Now let's go. And then it just melts in your mouth. Today we're returning to Leroy and Lewis, known as one of the best barbecue stops in Texas. We're back today, arriving a half hour before they open. Yesterday we missed out because they sold out by the time we reached the line. Known for their new school barbecue, old school service, they won the best new food truck by Eater Austin in 2017. And they are ranked in the top 10 best barbecue joints by Texas Monthly. They're known for their beef cheeks. I've never had beef cheeks before, so I can't wait to give them a try. But I wanted to share, they are moving to a brick and mortar, which I'll leave the new address in the description below. But good for them, that's exciting. All right, so I'm gonna dig into the beef cheek here. Okay. Okay. It's so rich and like beefy tasting. It's just, oh my god, and the fattiness on it. It's like a, a like a nice coating of fat. It's not too much, not too little. It just glides in the mouth. Wow, delicious. Wow. <laughs> so now we're gonna try the brisket. Look at that. Look at that brisket. Ah! Wow. Again, how are they getting this fattiness just perfect? It's really good. I love the bark on the bark on the end. I'm trying to decide which one I like better, but I like them both. They're both delicious and so well prepared. You couldn't go wrong ordering either one. Wow. I have to say, the way they perfected the fat on the meat is like nothing I've ever tasted before. I've never had the perfect, like it's just the perfect lining of fat, and then it just melts in your mouth. Amazing. So you can check out Leroy and Lewis at their new location, 5621 Emerald Forest Drive in Austin, or their website states that as of March 2024, the food truck remains open at Cosmic Coffee and Beer, Wednesday through Sunday, 11 a.m. to 5. We're here at Distant Relatives. The truck is located in the lot by Meanwhile Brewing Company in South Austin, known for their modern African-American menu. Texas Monthly, Condé Nast Traveler, and Eater Austin, along with many others, have all highlighted the unique and flavorful barbecue by owner and pitmaster Damian Brockway. So that's why I'm here. I can't wait to try what everyone has been raving about. So, Distant Relative is on the same property as Meanwhile Brewing which is huge, huge brewing. They have a soccer field here with the kids. Then they're, they're having like a, a vintage flea market. My heart, my heart on the vintage flea market, please. It's my, up my alley. Gosh darn you, Texas. Things that you do, I just keep falling in love with you. We got the pulled pork and we got the spare ribs. I can see these spices like already on this. So I'm so excited to give it a try. Oh, I think it's spicy. <laughs> mm. Wow. Yeah. That was really good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, there's a there's a hit. Like when you first put it in your mouth, it's like any other pulled pork. But then there's this at the end. Where it hits your tongue. Like it hits your tongue at the end and it's like slowly burning. <laughs> it's really good. 
Here, let me try some of the sauce. Mmm. The sauce is good too. Mmm. Yeah, the sauce is supposed to be like amazing. So, the sauce is like sweet, and then you have like the saltiness, the spiciness of the pork, and oh, 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 what a great combination. Sweet and sour. Sweet and sour. Mm. And spicy. And a little spicy. Mm, 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 mm. Very good. All right, so this is a spare rib. Look at that. Look at it. Juicy. Look at the, the bark. The bark is like perfect. Very good. So let's give it a try. It looks really juicy and tender. Yeah. The meat's perfect. It's a, again, fattiness on this is delightful. Mmm. Oh, perfect. Oh, perfect. You know, you just can't beat Texas barbecue. What the heck? You can't. They also offer um, Brussels sprouts, which um, it's different. You know, a lot of places have the, you know, normal macaroni and cheese, uh, potato salad, you know, coleslaw, beans. beans. But this is a nice change up. I love Brussels sprouts. And oh, these look delicious. Oh, they are. They're freaking delicious. Wow. Wow. What a really different take on barbecue and how delicious. It just, the fusion is delicious. Mm. I love that. I love that. So, distant relative. So good. Amazing. I love the fusion, the different flavors. Not like anything I've had before. Pulled pork was delicious. The spare rib was like nothing I've ever had before. It was absolutely delicious. Wow, just phenomenal. My lips are a little, like a little tingly because you can tell it's just so different uh, than anything I've had before. So, mwah, love it. Nicolith Weight Craft Meats and Barbecue is one of the best barbecue joints in Texas. Opening in 2012, they are listed as one of the top 50 best barbecues by Texas Monthly. And they made the list of the 12 essential barbecue restaurants with Austin Eater. We came for the beef rib and unfortunately, the people right before us got the very last one. Just our luck. So if you want the beef rib, you gotta come early. You gotta come early. <laughs> so we got the sliced pork shoulder and we got some sausage. And I'm ready to dig in. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, the spices on the end, the bark. Mm. Wow. That was super juicy. Mmm, that's probably some of the juiciest pork I've ever had. Wow. There's a layer of fat on it. Just at the end. It's just like, tails off. Wow. That is delicious. I don't think I've ever had pork before. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. This is really, really good. Wow. Should we try the sausage? Could the sausage be? any better? I don't know. I mean, that pork is delicious. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's really good, too. Wow. It has this smoky flavor. It just, like, pops out. Oh. Mm. Delicious, this is great, fantastic. Wow, that was incredible. I have to say that was the best pork shoulder I've ever had in my life. It was just so tender, so juicy. I've never had pork shoulder like that before. I, I was 42 years old and it stunned me. It stunned me. So I can't imagine what else like the beef rib would be like here. So absolutely delicious, highly recommend. You gotta come here. And it's just a chill, cool vibe.
You'll love it. KG Barbecue is the Eater Award-winning barbecue truck in the MLK neighborhood that is all about Egyptian Texan smoked meats and dishes. Bon Appetit highlighted Kareem, the Egyptian pit master, as he's transforming Texas barbecue by incorporating the bright flavors of the Middle East. So this is the brisket rice bowl. It has Mediterranean rice. It has um, the smoked brisket, the bellini salad, the tahini, candied nuts, and pomegranate seeds. Oh my gosh. Wow. That is amazing. It's like the best mix of both worlds. Mediterranean, like fresh, the, the cucumbers and tomatoes, and then you have the rice with that smoked brisket. Oh my god. And that sauce gives it some extra, like, layers of, I don't know, just, like, flavor. Oh, my gosh. I can eat this all day. I really could. It is so good. This is the smoked lamb chop with chimichurri. Wow. Oh. The chimichurri has, like, a spiciness to it. Like it is really spicy compared to chimichurri that I've had before. And it doesn't even have like the red, it doesn't even have like red, like flakes on it, but it is delicious. Wow, it's so tender. That is great. Ooh, hot, spicy. That was absolutely incredible. That was the best rice bowl I've ever had in my life. What is going on, Texas? I keep, at one after another food truck, I just keep having the best meal of my life. I, my husband keeps saying we're moving here. It, it's possible with all this amazing food. We might have to. So that concludes this week's video. The barbecue here in Austin never disappoints. It was amazing. Any of the places we showed you would be great places to try barbecue. You can also check out my Franklin barbecue. I'll link it somewhere. <laughs> but for more fun, more food, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you on the next video.